The strut is supported by a pin at C and an A36 steel guy wire AB. If the wire has a diameter of 0.2 inches, determine how much it stretches when the distributed load acts on the strut. State if Hooke's law is applicable or not. So first thing we're going to do is um, free body diagram. So this force here is the distributed load, which is base times height divided by 2 since it's a triangle so that's going to be 900 pounds we can do the sum of the moments so about C equal 0 and that'll be 900 times 3 clockwise plus that's going to be F A D set sine. So that angle is 30 degrees. That's 90. So that 30 right there. 30 degrees times the distance, which is 9 feet. So we get F A D equals. 600 pounds. Okay, so the next thing we need to do would be to calculate the area of the cable AB. And we're given that the wire has a diameter of 0 0.2 inches. So we can use the equation area equals pi over 4 times diameter squared, so 0.2 inches squared. We get 0 0.0314 inches squared. Now we can calculate sigma, which equals the force over the area. So we have 600 over 0.0314, and that equals 19.11 KSI. Now if you notice, what the question has asked, state of Hooke's law is applicable or not, our sigma um, for AB is less than sigma yield, 36 KSI, which means Hooke's law does apply, so it is linear elastic. And so the next part of the question asks what the, uh, the stretch is, how much it stretches. So we can do displacement equals PL over AE. So P is the 600 pounds length. So we need to calculate that L for the wire. Uh, one way we can do that, let's label this as H. And say sine of 60 degrees equals opposite 9 feet over hypotenuse of h. h equals 10.39 feet. So PL 
10.39 feet, we multiply that by 12 inches per foot. Area we said is 0.0314 inches squared. P is 29 times 10 to the power of 3 KSI. And your answer is 0 0.08. Thank you.